is action-packed football, featuring the Washington State College Cougars, one of the West's most exciting football teams, seen each week meeting a top gridiron power. Hello, everybody. This is Keith Jackson at the Los Angeles Memorial Coliseum, where this afternoon the Washington State College Cougars meet the UCLA Bruins. The Cougars looking for their second consecutive win here in the Coliseum, having beaten USC 13-12 here last fall. And looking for the first victory over UCLA since 1937, Washington State has won the toss elected to receive. Quickly, let us check the starting lineups for the Cougars. Number 87, co-captain Don Ellingson at left end. Number 78, Ray Blear at left tackle. 68, Bill Berry at left guard. Number 52, co-captain Marvin Nelson at center. Number 60, Angelo Bravelli at right guard. Number 70, Mike Lindsay at right tackle. Number 86, Bill Steiger at right end. At quarterback, 27, Dave Wilson. At left halfback, 22, Keith Lincoln. At right halfback, 23, Leroy Rath. And uh, at 42, Chuck Morrell, the starting fullback. For the UCLA Bruins, number 81, John Brown, left end. Number 78, Trucy Morris, uh, left tackle. Number 61, Bob King, left guard. Number 53, Harry Baldwin at center. Number 62, Rod Cochran at right guard. Number 70, Tony Longo at right tackle. Uh, number 86, uh, Captain Jim Stephan at right end. Number 30 is Dave Peterson, the quarterback. At left halfback will be Chuck Kendall, number 11. Number 38, Phil Parslow at right halfback. And number 21, Ray Smith at fullback. All right, here we go with the opening kickoff. Captain Jim Steppen kicking for UCLA, receiving Ellingson and Lincoln, and it's Ketchy with the ball. Carl Ketchy comes up to the 31-yard line, first and 10 for the Cougars. Now let's set the backfield for you. Washington State in receiving. Comes with Ketchy at left halfback, Chuck Morrell at fullback, and Rath at the slot back position. Off the flanker tee with the end split, and Wilson is your quarterback. And it's Morrell into the middle, and he goes up close to the 35-yard line. All right, mark it just shy of the 35. Call it second down, six yards to go, as Wilson looks in for the snap from center. UCLA up there now in a four-man line with two linebackers in real close. And a fumble. Wilson picks it up. And Wilson's out of bounds, uh, up just about the 41-yard line and very close to a first down. The ball is just short of the first down by a matter of eight or ten inches, so it's third down and less than a foot. And Morrell dives in for the first down up to the 30 to the 44-yard line. The wind blowing like 60 up here on the roof of the Coliseum this afternoon. That's Ketchy breaking loose, fumbles the ball. Bruins recover it. So Ketchy hit real hard after he almost got loose. Loses the ball to UCLA at the 46 in Cougar territory. And that's Chuck Kendall with the football. He doesn't go very far. In fact, I think he lost a couple of yards, at least one yard on the play. A loss of a yard, make it second down, 11 yards to go at the 47. Kendall is the tailback in the UCLA single wing, strong side to the right. Parslow trying to go, couldn't find it. Another yard loss. Make it a two-yard loss as Lindsay came in to dump Parslow. Make it uh, third down and 13 yards to go now. And they are strong to the left side as Kendall stands up and looks to throw deep. Throws deep. Got a man. Too long. Fourth down, 13 yards to go for UCLA. Now they shift into punt formation with Stefan going back in punt formation, standing all the way back at his own 38-yard uh, line. Carl Ketchy and Don Ellingson are the deep men. And the kick is away, and it's a good kick. And it's Ketchy with the football, dodging uh, tackler, getting some blocking, but can't come up to the 20. They get him at the 18. Washington State, 3-3 three and three on the season. Three and two in the conference, UCLA two and four on the season. Pitch out is to Chuck Morrell. And he is up to, is close to the 27. Second down and two yards to go. Gain of eight yards on Morrell's run to the left side. Cougars in white uniforms, and it's given off to uh, Ketchy this time, and uh, Carl Ketchy is in for about a yard, and that's all. Third down, one yard to go for Washington State. 
at the 28th. And they give it to Morrell, and Morrell, no, a beautiful fake in there. And uh, Wilson keeping on the Valley Series goes for the first down of the 31. So Washington State grinding it out here without the big rifle. Bob Newman did not make the trip. Some offside down below. Against UCLA. Some changes in the Washington State lineup now. Keith Lincoln has come on at uh, left halfback. And Don Ellisick has come on at left end replacing uh, Don Ellingson. And it's Wilson giving to Rath. Rath can't find much running room as the Bruins are waiting for him. And it's uh, now second down and about four yards to go. Second and a little more than three. Call it a short four. That's Morrell cutting back. First down, Cougars up near the 45-yard line. UCLA is still in that four-man line. Two linebackers in close. As Wilson on the keeper dives into the middle of the line for short yardage. All right, the ends are split, and Wilson is still your quarterback. Wilson is keeping. Back to throw. Shoots it. Got a man. It's complete. And it's Steiger into UCLA territory at the 43-yard line. The Cougars sending uh, Steiger the split right end into the secondary along with the slot back uh, Rath. Wilson hit uh, Steiger for the gain, and it's uh, Morrell. They were looking for him. Down he goes. Gain of a yard. Not a cloud in the sky this afternoon. Beautiful sunny day. A little warm down below on the stadium as Wilson pitches it back to Lincoln. This fella can drive on you. He's in close to the first down. First down for the Cougars as they run the UCLA defensive end positions here. Wilson, number 27, the quarterback. And the give is to Morrell. And this time, Charlie has hit very hard as he got just about to the 30. Second and nine, just short of the 30-yard line. The Cougars in Bruin territory. That's Lincoln. Option, throws it, got a man, Steiger, touchdown, touchdown Cougars. All right, the Cougars come up now for the PAT. That was Lincoln to Steiger for 31 yards and a touchdown, and the Cougars take the lead 6-0, and the pitch is back to Morrell. He goes, two points, Cougars lead it 8-0. Keith Lincoln now will kick off for Washington State. The Cougars lead it eight to nothing, marching 81 yards. And it's a good kick all the way out of the end zone. The uh, Bruins will come up with it first and 10 at the 20. UCLA is in here with a new lineup. We'll have to pick up the numbers. The numbers are a little bit obscure. The tailback driving straight ahead, breaking almost into the clear. Nate Smith going for a little more than 10 yards and a first down for UCLA. Single wing to the right now. Smith is the tailback. And the fullback moving with the ball. 20, number 25, Gaines hits up to the 35-yard line. Are the Bruins weave out of that uh, huddle. Cougars shifting their defenses a little bit now. Single wing is to the left side. And it's back to the fullback. Reverse given off to the wingback. And the wingback Luster goes first down at the 40 for UCLA. For the UCLA backfield now is Luster, Gaines, and Nate Smith at tailback. And the reverse is off to Luster again. And Luster is up for another first down as the Bruin ground game starts to roll. Penalty flag on the field. Picked up against Washington State. 15 yards. First and 10 for UCLA now on the Washington State 39-yard line. The 15-yard penalty marked off. 
And the Bruins are in pretty good shape now. First and ten at the Cougar 39. Single wing is to the right. It's back to Nate Smith. He runs it. And he's got about five yards. Second down, five yards to go at the 34. Bruins moving now. Cougars lead at 8-0. We're still in the first period. Fumble! Picked up! And Lester lost the ball, picks it up, and goes for the first down on the Washington State 28. Mark it on the just inside the 28. First and 10 for UCLA. Nate Smith. This time they're looking for him and stop him after a yard. They give him two, make it second and eight at the 25. Nate Smith is the tailback. Luster on the wing. Gains the fullback, and it's Nate Smith, the tailback with the ball. Hurtling over the blockers to about the 25. Third and still eight. At the 25. Smith. Got some good blocking out of that single wing and goes close to the first down again. First down, UCLA at the Washington State 17. All right, UCLA now with the first down, 10 on the Washington State 17. Ruins driving. Move from their own 20. Carl Ketchy out of the ball game. And the fullback, Gaines, dives into the 15-yard line. Second down, eight yards to go. Gain of two on the plunge by Gaines, the fullback. These Bruin numbers very difficult to see. That's Nate Smith, the tailback, slipping and sliding his way close to the 11-yard line. Nate Smith and Gene Gaines have been the big men in this drive. Third down and four at the 11. And it's Smith with it. And they get him right at the 10-yard line. It brings up fourth down and three. All right, it's fourth down and three yards to go, and uh, UCLA is going for the field goal. Wilson. Kirk Wilson, field goal. number 26, will kick from the left side and kick from the 20. It's no good. He kicked it from the 16-yard line, just outside the 16. Kirk Wilson attempting the field goal. It was no good at Washington State College. We'll take possession of the football. First and ten at the 20, leading eight to nothing. All right, Washington State leading eight to nothing comes on from their own. Mike Agee is in there at quarterback. Moving from their own 20-yard line. Kano at left halfback gets about one yard. Kano is the fullback. Lincoln is the uh, halfback along with Rath, and A.G. is the quarterback, and it's Rath running the reverse for no gain at the left side. They're down about eight yards to go for Washington State. The ends are split, and the quarterback is Mike A.G. Keeping the ball, throws it. Oh, and it's no good. Uh, he had two men out there, the slot back and the left half, and Rath, the deep man, looked to be the intended target. It was dropped by Lincoln. It's fourth down now as Keith Lincoln punts from his own 11-yard line. High snap. Gets it off. He was hurried. It's a good kick. <laughs> and they, they get him back there at the 40-yard line. Rudy Malabar back to the 35, but it's first down and 10 UCLA at the 40. And as Marvin Lester is dropped, taking the punt, the quarter ends. The score at the quarter... Washington State, eight, UCLA nothing. UCLA now will move to the attack with that first string unit back in there from the 40. And there's a reverse to Parslow, breaks into the clear, goes all the way to the Washington State 48-yard line. First and 10 as they line up again, single wing to the left at the Cougar 48. 
And they give it off to Parslow again. Penalty flags go down, and Parslow is held up at the 41. Holding against UCLA. All right, this makes it first down 25 yards to go. At the UCLA 38, the Bruins have the ball. They are in a single wing to the right side, and the give is to Parslow, and again, he's got daylight. Oh, that same play, and again, he goes back up to the 48-yard line in Cougar territory. Parslow having a busy afternoon. Wingback getting a lot of yardage off that reverse play. Single wing to the left. Ball comes back to uh, the tailback, Smith. And Smith getting some tremendous blocking. Goes all the way down to the Washington State 36-yard line. The Bruins marching Washington State College, realizing they've got to come up with another defense and stop the Bruins. The score is 8 to nothing, and the Cougars ask for a timeout. At the Bruins on the march, first and 10 at the 35. They've overcome a 15-yard holding penalty in this drive, too. And it's Nate Smith. Breaking clear all the way to the 18-yard line, first and 10, UCLA. The Oakland's really cracking in there on the getting some great blocking out of that front line. Single wing is off to the left, and the Cougars now go up into almost a seven-man line as the fumble! UCLA recovers the ball, but it's all the way back to the 30-yard line as uh, Parslow came back to pick up the loose football. All right, it's second down now, and about 21 yards to go. Almost 22 yards to go for UCLA. They've had a little tough luck on this offensive drive. Nate Smith dives in and gets two yards before the defensive sidebacks can come up along with Chuck Morrell. Third down, 20 yards to go. Bruins might open up and start throwing here. Nate Smith, the tailback, and he stands straight up and looks in the pocket. Shoots it long, he's got a man. It's intercepted. Fumbled. Cougars with the ball. And they'll be just about at the one yard line. Washington State, first and 10 at the one yard line. The ball was intended for John Brown, the left end. Ellingson intercepted. Brown hit him. He fumbled. Finally, the Cougars uh, recovered the ball at the one-yard line. And that is Chuck Morrell breaking clear to the nine-yard line. Second down, about a yard and a half for Washington State. Oh, they were just <laughs> about in there for a safety. The fullback, Morrell, dives in, and I think he's got the first down. First and ten for the Cougars. They're out. At the 12 now. Pounding right up the middle. Give is off to Morrell. Comes up across the 15 to the 16, maybe the 17. Make it second down, five to go at the 17. Morrell running that left side again. Cougars are running those UCLA ends pretty good here. That's Carl Ketchy up across the 20. Third down a yard to go at the 21. Both the ends are split, the flanker to the right side. And the fullback Morrell, Charlie Morrell, goes almost to the 25, and it's another first down for Washington State. Washington State now moving from just off their goal line, about a foot out of the end zone. They've got a first down at the 25 now as uh, Ketchy keeps and goes at the... 29, maybe the 30-yard line at the right side. Okay. Make the last play, Wilson on the option. You'll see that this afternoon. The Cougars running that option along the line, almost a belly series. This time it's Eddie Stevens coming up to the 30-yard line. Third down and five yards to go as Ed Stevens is in at fullback along with Keith Lincoln. Reverse, oh, oh boy, they let him get in there that time. The Bruin defensive line in for a five-yard loss on Steiger on the reverse play, and it brings up fourth down and undoubtedly a punting down. So Lincoln will kick from his own 14. Parslow in a single safety, a good snap. Gets a big rush, but a great kick, a great kick. Parslow, over Parslow's head, bouncing around. Oh, they're going to crunch him. They got him all the way back on the eight-yard line.
Ball is uh, just about at the nine yard line, first and ten for UCLA. And that's Smith. Fumble! Cougars recover at the 15 yard line, first and ten for Washington State College. The defensive right side of that Washington State line really whacked Mr. Smith that time. There's the pitch off to Lincoln. He's got about two yards. Gain of a little less than two yards, so let's make it second and nine. Wilson keeping. Throws. Good. Inside the 10 to the 8 yard line. Let's see the man come up. Who caught it? Leroy Rath made the catch at the 8. Third down, 3 yards for the first down. Third down, 8 yards for the touchdown. That's Ed Stevens. Oh, he goes to the 5 yard line. Short of the first down. Well, some of the crowd thought uh, Stevens uh, had bumbled that ball. It's fourth down and a yard to go. Fourth and a yard and a big play. And Lincoln dives in there, and he's very close to the first down. It's a big play. They are more than likely to bring in the change on this one. It's that close. Let's watch it and see as they unstack them. Very close. The defensive captain probably... No, first down and goal to go at the four-yard line for Washington State College. I thought sure that defensive captain was going to say, bring those sticks in. Keith Lincoln. And they get him right at the line of scrimmage. Second down and four yards for Washington State. About four and a half yards of the touchdown. Jump pass. Oh, it's dropped by Ellersick. Drop, jump pass, dropped. Third down and four and a half. Four minutes left to play. Wilson keeping, throwing. Oh, just over Keith Lincoln's fingertips, and it's fourth down. Fourth down and four and a half yards for a touchdown. This is a big play. Jump pass. Caught by Ellisick. Touchdown, Washington State. Great catch by Ellisick. A great catch by Ellisick. He was wrecked by two defensive men just as the ball hit him, but he held on, and the Cougars take a 14 to nothing lead. And they're going for two. That's Lincoln. Lincoln. And he's held short. And it is Washington State 14. UCLA nothing with three minutes, 55 seconds left to play in the first half. Lincoln kicks off for Washington State, and it gets a long one into the end zone. Kendall takes it, decides not to run it out, touches it down, and uh, UCLA will take it at the 20, first and 10. Well, the Cougar defenses have stiffened twice and stopped UCLA on long drives, and they've counted uh, two touchdowns and a single PAT. And Kendall running, looking downfield, gets a man, throws a lob pass out there, and it's incomplete. Had a man short, a man deep. He took the short man and missed him. A shift is off to the left side this time. Washington State now up in a five-man line. Linebackers are in tight. Fullback straight ahead. Short yardage, about three yards by Gene Gaines, the UCLA fullback. UCLA with the ball at their 23. Ball is back to Kendall. Got some room. He goes for the first down up to the 31 yard line. Three minutes to play. UCLA grinding it on the ground. They've not uh, been successful with their passing game so far. Kendall back to throw. Shoots a deep one. Dropped. Dropped. Close though. Kurovich almost came down with that football on that play, and if he had, he'd have been gone for six. Substitutions in the UCLA backfield. That's Gaines uh, spinning on the play and keeping, and it looks like a mix-up as the Cougars come crushing in and stop him for a yard and a half loss. So that make it a half a yard loss and call it second down 11. 
Third and 11. Third and 11. Triple reverse. Brown has it. And he's all the way up to the 43 yard line. That was Jim Johnson at left end with, on the triple reverse, the end around. Rather than Brown, Brown out of there, and Jim Johnson in at left end. That's Kendall. Kendall. And they whack him soundly as he comes up for about four yards. Third down in a short seven yard line, a short seven yards at the 47. Kendall throwing. Gets good protection. Got a man down there. It's no good. No good. Third and six and a half at the 47 for UCLA. They're going to the air here without success right now. Kendall, number 11. Getting the big rush here. Greg's after him. Throws it downfield. And it's no good. It is no good. Number 85 downfield. Almquist couldn't come up with it. Fourth and six now as the Bruins shift into punt formation. With Ketchy and Ellersick deep as twin safeties for Washington State and Chuck Kendall is kicking from his 34. Gets that good soft snap. Gets it out of there. It's a good kick. It's Ellersick. And he comes up to the 23. First and 10 at the 23. A minute left to play in the first half. And up the middle. Fumble. UCLA recovers Ted Kano's fumble at the Washington State 37 yard line. Kano had a lot of daylight. He's beefing a little about the call. There was a long delay on the whistle as the officials ruled the ball was still in play all the way. And UCLA takes over at the 38 yard line, first and 10, with about 40 seconds left to play in the first half. All right, it's Ray Smith at fullback, Chuck Kendall at tailback for UCLA, and it's Kendall back to throw. Getting some room, keeps the ball, and uh, they throw him out of bounds at just about the line of scrimmage. All right, the Bruins come up in a single wing shift off to the left side this time. Second down, 10 yards to go. 35 seconds left to play in the first half, and Kendall going way back, way back, being pursued. Gets his pass away, and it's incomplete. It's third down, 10 yards to go for UCLA. 30 seconds to play in the first half. Kendall's going to throw it. Shoots it long, and uh, it's intercepted by Steiger. And he's all the way out to the 30-yard line, first and 10, Washington State. And the clock is running. We may or may not have a play here. There's a Cougars break the huddle. Time just about gone in the first half. And there is the end of the first half. With a score, Washington State College 14, UCLA Bruins nothing. 22 marching bands on the field as UCLA observes high school band day here in the Coliseum. Washington State eight first downs of the first half, UCLA 10. The Cougars drove uh, 81 yards for the first touchdown. The PAT was good. Uh, Cougars recovered a fumble on the UCLA 15 yard line, drove in for another six points. The PAT was no good, and they lead it at halftime 14 to nothing. And conducting the masked high school bands this afternoon will be Meredith Wilson of Music Man fame, and uh, you'll probably hear some strains from Music Man before the halftime show is done. Kicking off for Washington State College to start the second half. Keith Lincoln just about missed the football and it's grabbed over there at midfield by John Brown, the left end. No, number 78 would be Trucy Norris, the left tackle. So a bad kick and UCLA comes up with it. First down and 10 at the Washington State 49 yard line as we start the second half of play with Washington State leading 14 to nothing. And Nate or Skip Smith, let's call him Skip. Is that tailback, the spinner, fullback, Ray Smith. And Ray Smith dives in there for close to five yards. Second and five at the 44. And the second half gets off and going quickly. Ray Smith, number 21, hitting to close to the 40-yard line. Be short of the first down by a yard and a half or so. Third and one. Bad kickoff to start it. May have uh, caused a little trouble here for the Cougars. And the Bruins have a first down. 
as Smith, Skip Smith, goes for the first down at the 35. First and ten at the Washington State 35. Skip Smith, close to another first down at the 25. Peterson at quarterback for UCLA, the blocking back. The tailback is Skip Smith. The fullback is number 21, Ray Smith. And Parslow on the wing. And it's the fullback, Ray Smith, plunging inside the 20 to the 17. First down, UCLA. First and 10 on the Washington State 17. And the Bruins getting the break on the kickoff are driving. Ray Smith is hit very hard. And Don Ellisick comes up and stops him after a gain of two. Three yards. Third and a second and a short seven for UCLA. At the Washington State 13. Reverse. Parslow turns the corner. Out of bounds at the six yard line. Nice running by Phil Parslow. First and goal to go for UCLA at the six yard line. Having moved from the 50. And that's Skip Smith. He is hit at the three. Second two and a half for the touchdown. 14 nothing. UCLA threatening to get on the board here now. Tailback Skip Smith. Touchdown UCLA. They're going for two. They almost have to. Skip Smith running to the left. He's in for two points. Good blocking, and it's 14 Washington State, 8 UCLA. Bruins have come up with eight points here to start the second half. Jim Steppen will kick off for UCLA. 14 to 8 now, and the bad kickoff. Wilson finally gives it away. That's Morrell with it, and Morrell is out to the 34-yard line where the Cougars have it first and 10. 14-yard kickoff return by Chuck Morrell. Dave Wilson is the quarterback, and Wilson keeps it. Throws it long. It's caught, complete. It's caught by Steiger. Touchdown, Washington State. No. Yes, touchdown, touchdown. A great play, Steiger took that football right away from Stephan, took it right out of his hand, and it goes for the touchdown from the 34-yard line. 66 yards on the pass play from Wilson to Steiger, and the Cougars lead it 20 to eight. Oh boy, like a shot out of the blue, like that play SC came up with last week to win the ball game at Spokane. Whew. All right, the Cougars are going for two here. They lead it 20 to eight. And it's Morrell at the left side. Two points, 22 Washington State College, eight UCLA. Hold on to your hat. Well, we get our breath back here and Keith Lincoln kicks off. Let's see if he can get the toe into this one. He does. It's a little short though. Up to the 12 yard line by Lester, Marvin Lester, and they've got him at the 32 yard line. Well, UCLA is up there now. We'll check these, this backfield for you. Lester is in at the wing. Ray Smith at fullback, and Ray Smith has it right now, and he is really going, and the penalty flag goes down as Ray Smith turns all the way out to the 43 yard line. Penalty flag is on the deck down below, and it's a penalty against. UCLA for holding. All right, the Bruins are assessed the 15 yard holding penalty. Makes it first and 25. And Skip Smith running behind the single wing. Turns the corner. Look out. He's all the way out to the 40 yard line, the 41 yard line before they finally get him. Second down, one yard to go now, just outside the 41 yard line. Bruins coming roaring out of that single wing, really getting the blocking. 
That's Skip Smith again, and he's got the first down in Washington State territory at the 48-yard line. All right, the Bruins roaring back here. You're getting some real effective tough blocking off that single wing. They're down by 14. The Cougars lead 22 to 8, third quarter. Skip Smith, the tailback. This time he is uh, ganged up on and dropped for about a yard loss. Great play in there as Virhai was in on it. Marvin uh, Nelson, Ron Green is in on the play and the man on the bottom of the pile. Virhai, we might point out, wearing number 71 today. Normally worn by Koppel. Single wing to the left for the Bruins. Ball back to uh, Skip Smith. Getting some pressure. Throws the ball. And it's almost intercepted. Cogdell dropped it. All right, the Bruins move up now into a single wing to the right. Third down and 10 yards to go on the Washington State 48. And Skip Smith is at the right side. This time, uh, Ellersick gets the arms around him, but they don't get him before he goes in there for about five yards. Fourth and a little less than five for UCLA at the Washington State 42. Now back in punt formation goes Steffens. Kirk Wilson it is. Kirk Wilson, number 26. They're not kicking, they're keeping. Look out! Great play in there. By Lester, 33. Marv Lester, first down for UCLA at the Washington State 18-yard line. Ball was snapped with a short man off the punt formation. Lester, and he made it a first down at the Cougar 18-yard line, and the Bruins are knocking on the door again. Skip Smith. Kirk Wilson. Kirk Wilson in there. These UCLA numbers bear great resemblance to each other, these 20s that the tailbacks wear. It's Kirk Wilson, the tailback. And he has it. Looks. Throws it down the middle, it's caught. Completed in there to number 86, Stephan. And it's a first down and goal to go for UCLA at the Washington State College eight yard line. First and goal for the Bruins at the Cougar eight yard line. Single wing shift off to the right. That's Kirk Wilson. Ellersick stops him at the two. The Bruins really driving here in the third quarter. Second and two. Fullback, Ray Smith, is short of the goal line. Their high led the defensive surge that kept him out of there. The ball is about four inches away from the goal line. Same play. And he again is short. He's short. Stopped this time for a loss. They mark it just about eight inches away now, and it's fourth down. Fourth and inches. The Cougars uh, standing up here to the charge of the Bruins. Let's see if they can do it four times running. Touchdown, UCLA. Kirk Wilson scored it. The Bruins come up to go for two. The score now is 22 to 14. Big play. Chuck Kendall, and they've got him short. And the score remains 22 to 14. Washington State College leads with five and a half minutes to play in the third period. Marv Lester kicking off for the Bruins. It's a spinning kick picked up by Chuck Morrell. Breaks into the clear. He can make it all the way. He is going all the way. It's a touchdown. Washington State. Chuck Morrell racing about 84 yards for a touchdown. <laughs> Holy mackerel. The score now is Washington State College 28, UCLA 14. The Cougars electrified the crowd a few minutes ago with a pass play from Wilson to Stagger and now Morrell on the kickoff races about six, about 84 yards from the 16-yard line for the touchdown. And the score now is 28 to 14. Whoo, it takes your breath away. We've had fireworks in the third quarter, haven't we? It's Morrell again, going for two, and he dives and he's in, and the score is 30 to 14. Washington State leads. Lee Schroeder will kick off now for Washington State, and it's Kendall deep to receive, and Schroeder roots it pretty good. 
Kendall lets it to bounce around in the end zone and then steps to the ball, touches it down. Bruins, first and 10 at the 20. Well, the Cougars lead this one 30 to 14 now in a sensational third quarter in Chuck Kendall at the right side. And he isn't going very far. Great play over there by Bill Steiger. Gene Gaines, the fullback. The tailback is Chuck Kendall. And the reverse is off to Luster. And he doesn't go very far either. In fact, he lost a yard. Single wing to the right. Kendall going to throw it. Getting some pressure. Lobs it out there. It's incomplete, almost intercepted. UCLA has assessed 15 yards back to the two-yard line for an illegal return to the ball game by one of the players. And now Chuck Kendall will have to punt and his uh, heel will be just about on his the restraining line of the end zone. He's in real trouble and he gets a little bit of pressure but he gets a wobbly kick out of there. And they're going to let it bounce upfield. And it rolls dead at the UCLA 34 yard line where the Cougars will put it in play at that point. First down and 10. Let's set the Washington State backfield for you now as we can. Uh, Price is the quarterback. Throws the ball down here and misses his man Lee Schroeder number 31 the slot back. Mike Agee, number 10, now your quarterback. Jeff Price out of the ball game. Second and 10. And it's Agee keeping at the right side. Throws it. And it's caught by Schroeder. A tremendous crunching tackle at the 30 yard line. Cougar backfield is Agee, Ketchy, Stevens. Pass over there to uh, catch uh, to Ellersick. Ellersick is good for about almost four yards. It's fourth down and two yards to go for Washington State. Now, let's see what uh, Mike Agee likes to call. Gives to Stevens. Stevens dives, and I think he's got his first down. He has. Cougars in white, first and 10 at the Bruin 22. Jump pass caught oh, by Ellersick. Short gain, three and a half, four yards. Second and seven. Agee jump pass. Good to Schroeder. Schroeder's got a first down at the UCLA six yard line. A minute 25 seconds to play in the third period. Cougars are knocking on the door. First and goal at the six. And A.G. rolling out. Keeps it. Goes inside the five. Just inside the five. Second and five. Cogdale in. A.G. being pursued. Gets his pass away. Touchdown to Cogdale. Great play by A.G. He was hit through the ball anyway. And the Cougars go into the lead 36 to 14. Going for two. That's Stevens. Good for two, and the score is 38 Washington State College, 14 UCLA. Dick Koppel, number 76, kicks off for, uh, uh, for Washington State. It's picked up back there by Gene Gaines, and he is out to the 25 yard line. First and 10 UCLA with a minute to play in the third period. First and 10 for the Bruins at the, their own 25. That's Kendall. Oh, oh, fierce tackle at the left side as that defensive left end would give nothing. Don Moore in there to make it. We've had five touchdowns scored in this quarter. Three by Washington State and two by UCLA. Kendall. Oh, boy, you can feel that one up here. Again on the play of almost five. And the third quarter ends with Washington State College leading UCLA by a score of 38 to 14. We pick up the action to start the final quarter, third and five. UCLA with the ball in their own territory, and that is Kurt Wilson throwing to the right, and it's caught. Caught, and it's good for the first down. First and ten for UCLA at the 35. Well, that ball is about an inch short of being a first down, and the Bruins are going to go for it, down by 24 points. And uh, Ray Smith bucks in and gets the first down at about the 39. First and 10, just short of the 40 for UCLA. That's Kirk Wilson. Oh, great play over there by Don Moore. Fought off the blockers and brought him down back at the 35. A loss on the play of four and a half yards. Bruins send a flanker way wide. Pass incomplete, too high, intended for Brown. Third and 14 for the Bruins. They've got a slot back out here, and they've got a wing uh, 
In split and a long lob pass out here. It is caught by Brown and it's complete to Brown at the Washington State 48 yard line. This time, Parslow, the wing back at the left, and Brown are split and they're going deep. And Kendall's going to throw it. He throws it for Brown again and it's good to Brown again. And it's good for another first down at the Washington State 37 yard line. Just short of the first down, they rule. Second down and about a foot to go. And Kendall running to the right, being pursued. Can't get it away. Yes, he does get it away, and it's thrown away, incomplete. Third down. Third and about a foot for the first down. The Bruins will probably go for the first down here. Nope, they're going to still throw that ball. Kendall gets it away. Intended for Brown, and it misses Brown, and it's fourth down and a foot to go. Fourth down, and this time the play is into the line. Ray Smith going for the first down to the Washington State 35, first and 10 for the Bruins. All right, Nathan Skippy Smith is back in at tailback to pull the trigger for UCLA, and Ray Smith, the fullback, breaks through the middle as Washington State goes offside, and the Bruins will probably decline that penalty and take the gain. Quarterback Dave Peterson elects to go for the penalty instead, and they have a first and five at the 30, and uh, Skippy Smith dives into the line and moves close to a first down. First and 10 for the Bruins at the 49, and it's Skippy Smith at the left side. And Lee Schroeder comes over and stops him after a yard gain. Make it second down and eight at the 47 with a little less than seven minutes to play in the football game. Fumble! Who's got it? I think UCLA retained possession. Two Cougars pounced in there. That's Koppel, number 76, getting up. Who has it? Who has it? Who has it? Kano on the bottom of the pile. Washington State! Washington State! Ted Kano recovered the football. Cougars refused a holding penalty against the Bruins, elected to take possession of the ball, and now they now own it as Kano has it. And he's in a little trouble. And <laughs> they knock him down back on the 41-yard line as he tried to reverse his field. A loss of nine yards, second and 19, as A.G. keeps it, goes back to throw, shoots it deep. Cogdale is down there, spattered around and knocked down, no good. He was home clear, just couldn't get the ball to him. Third down. Lincoln lobs it out there. It's intercepted. That's Kurt Wilson. They finally get him down at the Washington State 27-yard line. The pitch was off to Lincoln. Lincoln rushed on the play and got the lob pass away, but he threw way short, and the Bruins intercept. Kirk Wilson and uh, Gaines, the deep man. Wilson throwing. Almost intercepted by Don Ellingson. No good. Just about five minutes remain in the ball game as the ball comes back to Kirk Wilson to throw. Getting the rush. Shoots it out here in the flat. Good. And it's Steffens to the Washington State 15. First and 10 at the 15 for the Bruins. Spinning play and the give is off to Wilson. Just gets away. Pressure. Throws it. Touchdown. Complete for Steffens. Bruins going for two here. Wilson stands up to throw. Throws it. Intercepted by Kano. And it's no good. The score stands. Washington State 38, UCLA 20 with a little more than four minutes to play. Kirk Wilson kicking off for the Bruins. 38 to 20 the score. It's an onside kick and it's taken over there by number 53 for Washington State. It's Kevin Scanlon and Scanlon downs the ball at the 47 first and 10 for the Cougars. Both sides offside on the kickoff, and they kick it again. And again, it's uh, an onside kick picked up by Schroeder. Still going. And they get him now at the Washington State 47. Cougars up to the line with Price at quarterback. Jump pass. Good to Fanning. Fanning is in UCLA territory at the 39-yard line, first and 10. First and 10 for the Cougars at the Bruin 39. Give us to Kano. Kano drives to the 31-yard line, just shy of the 30. Gain of nine yards by Kano, second down and one, and Price throwing. Oh, they really suck him back on the 38-yard line. Make it the 38 and make it third and nine as Price comes in now to call the signals. Jump pass, good to Fanning. And Fanning dives for what may be another first down. Short of the first down. About a half a yard short, and Kano drives into the center and gets the first down. 
Two minutes to play. The Cougars have it at the UCLA 29 as Price keeps it. Throws it. Good to Ellingson. Ellie may be away. There he goes. He is down to the six-yard line. Penalty flag on the play. Penalty against Washington State, I believe. Clipping. Penalty sets the Cougars back to the 29 at first and uh, 10, and Schroeder is stopped at the line of scrimmage. Second down, about 11 yards to go as Price goes back to throw. Being chased, can't get it away, and they've got him back on the 33. Third and 14 now. This time Price keeps. They almost get him. Pressure on him over there. Fumbles it. UCLA recovers it. Nope, they rule the ball dead. They rule the ball dead. Minute exactly left to play. Fourth down. Mix up. Price smothered back on the 40 yard line. And UCLA will take over with 50 seconds to play in the ball game. Kendall has come on at tailback now. He'll obviously throw the football. Kevin Scanlon after him. Scanlon gets a hold of him, and uh, other Cougars come along to help, including Koppel. Davis, the wingback flank, so is Brown, the left end. And Kendall's throwing deep, gets it away just barely. Passes to Brown. Brown catches good at the 49. The last play of the ball game coming up, and Jim Sutherland is riding the shoulders of his Washington State College Cougars. The first time since 1937, Washington State has been able to defeat the University of California at Los Angeles. And this afternoon, the Cougars have whacked the Bruins a good one. The pass thrown downfield is incomplete, and the clock stops with just about four seconds left. Four seconds to play. Fourth down, UCLA, and Kendall is going to throw it. He can't do it. Scanlon clavers him right at the line of scrimmage, and the ball game ends, and Washington State College has defeated UCLA 38-20 to 20 at the Coliseum. So Washington State College picks up their first victory over the UCLA Bruins since 1937, winning this afternoon 38-20. to 20. Next week, the Bruins take on California up at Berkeley, another big ball game, and Washington State still hoping... Still wishing for a Rose Bowl bid now with only two defeats. Cal was beaten by Oregon State. The Cougars next week have the Oregon State College Beavers at Pullman homecoming. We'll look forward to seeing a lot of football fans at that one at Pullman next week. Now this is Keith Jackson speaking for cameraman Dick Cameron and inviting you to watch Washington State College football each week here on Channel 4. West Coast Airlines, serving the Pacific West, provides transportation for these sportscasts. Fly the brilliant new Fairchild F-27 prop jet liners on West Coast Airlines.